I mean, Obama was making a big statement today. I've seen him do it a few times now about this debt ceiling issue. He looks like he is positioning himself as the adult, which isn't that hard. <laughs> you know, he got a lot of flack a couple of weeks ago when he compared the Republicans to his 10-year-old daughter, which I think is an insult to 10-year-olds all over the country. <laughs> Okay. I, think, I think he's in a position now where he could claim to be the only person in the room who isn't Voldemort <laughs> at these negotiations. But is he Harry Potter? I hope so. Because we need a wizard to pull this one out of the fire. Because the Republicans seem bound and determined to drive the country off the cliff fiscally because they see no downside in it for them. Because people don't seem to realize, as my good friend Goldie says, uh, that the, the R's want to run on, you know, are you better off now than you were four years ago? And they're going to, they want to pin the recession, pin the economic collapse on Obama, and really claim, you know, it's the economy stupid. And I think Americans are going to need to be reminded that it's, it's stupid's economy still. George Bush drove the country off the cliff. <laughs>